find it, me and my students on YouTube and on the Penn website, I think, it's still there. We won a Johnson & Johnson competition for advancing nursing competition where we developed a video of us tap dancing EKGs and we won. My husband found me on YouTube. <laughs> so you're going to get to see this. Now, now, this, you will not, the students are not going to be asked to a quiz, but where are my seniors? Senior. Right, you know, when you're a senior, Debbie, you will do it. We'll All right, so this is it. The left foot is the atrium. The right foot is the ventricle. So sitting here as healthy hearts, we are in normal sinus rhythm. Got it? So, now, let's say you have not had your financial aid meeting. You're about to go in and meet with Antoinette, and we are in minus half the price. If you have your financial aid meeting and all is mellow, you are happy. We are in sinus bradycardia. Okay, so you get the basics. So we, we get excited and our heart rate goes up and we relax and they slow down. Okay? So we have more money. Right? Okay. My able assistant, Laura. <laughs> so, an abnormal beat, which is not terrible that you can have, is you can be going along in a normal rhythm and all of a sudden you have a premature beat. Aren't we great? We, re we rehearsed. <laughs> premature atrial contraction, okay? Pretty benign, not a big deal. But if you get too many of them, you can now go into a rhythm where the atria are banging away at 300 per minute. Unfortunately, the ventricle's not that fast, and this is called atrial flutter, and we will demonstrate a four to one flutter. <laughs> and it can get worse. The atria, can stop contracting. All they're doing is quivering. And we have to hang on to each other because this one's hard to do if you're not hanging on. The atria are just quivering, but the ventricle is still working. And that is atrial fibrillation. Now, is anybody in the room a nurse or physician, anything medical? Any someone here in the room? Okay, so this makes some sense. The others just think we're lunatic. <laughs> Nothing that can happen is the heart can have delayed conduction through the AV node and a type of heart block called Mobitz type 1 or Wanky Box. Okay, so we are going to do you have a normal beat, then you have an atrium with a longer PR interval, takes longer to get through the ventricle, followed by a beat that's not going to be with their more agile than I am. So this, so this is a top time where the AV node delays the impulse going through. So we're going to now demonstrate this one. So we do normal. cycle starts over again. Oops, see, they did it right. So that's the way you go. All right. Moving along. Now, this one you're getting more serious. You can have a premature beat that comes in just from the ventricle. So you're going in the sinus rhythm. This is called ventricular trigon. More looking at us like <laughs> You can have a beat, a run of a very rapid rhythm coming from the ventricle. So you're going to have a normal sinus rhythm, and all of a sudden, <laughs> then it just can work. So a 10 beat run of ventricular tachycardia, not good, but it gets worse. You can keep going in ventricular tachycardia. <laughs> ventricular fibrillation. The vent this is what was in the rhythm that, that Casey uh, was shocking today. She survived. Survived. Mm -hmm. But along comes a pen nurse with the defibrillator, shocks the patient, 